let's look at some extra bit of information and some configuration for project preparation phase. Now we need to do some activities in asset accounting to ensure that it is ready in the project preparation phase. So if you have not installed this note, you must install this SAP note 1939592. Get your basis administrator to install this note. Then you can run the program using transaction code SE38 and this is the program name RASFIN underscore MIGR underscore pre-check. And once you execute this transaction, it will do all the checks for new GL. It should be active. JVA is not active. Lease accounting engine is not active. Classic real estate is not active. There are no requests with regard to assets for funds management. All periodic postings are posted successfully and all relevant depletion areas for parallel currencies exist. And you should do this check in all the systems, dev, QAS and PRD. Now let's have a look at this in the system. So I'm going to SE38 to execute the program. Let's type it in over here. SE38. And here just enter the program. RASFIN underscore MIGR underscore pre-check. Then execute this program. And whichever simple finance release you want, whether one or two, you select that relevant release and execute the transaction. There's also an information menu path over here. You can see the program documentation if you want. Let's click on that. And it gives you all the information with regard to this. Uh, what does it does do and all the features. And you can see just what we discussed earlier. Make sure that these are not active like JVA, real estate, lease accounting engine, and from funds management, there are no reference to any assets. So you can see, read more on this documentation. I'm just going to close it now. And it also shows which note and all you need to install. So select whichever release you are using and then execute the transaction. And just get a message saying no errors found. You can use new asset accounting. If there are some any informational message, you can go and Double click those information message and then proceed to the relevant transactions to resolve those. But usually you will not find any problems. So you can pass this check. There are other checks which are required for asset accounting, which I have mentioned earlier in the presentation main slides. So this is more of a technical information. So you just have to execute this transaction. This does all the prerequisites before financial accounting, asset accounting migration. Now let's look at some settings in the project preparation phase. The SAP menu path, so once you come to the customizing menu, you can see here SAP Simple Finance add-on for SAP Business Suit powered by SAP HANA. So this is where we're going to do all the configurations. Scroll that down and you can see migration from SAP ERP just giving some information over here. Now we are in the project preparation phase, so that's this phase over here. Let's expand this icon and we'll be executing these two transactions in this presentation. The next presentations we'll look at general ledger, custom preparation, migration of general ledger, asset accounting and controlling. So you can see here the first activity in preparation is to check customizing settings prior to migration. So before you go on to the migration phase, what are the activities you need to do? Check customizing settings. So let's execute this transaction. And you can see check passed. So there's no problems. So this green message means you have successfully passed. You can proceed on to the next transaction.